Okay, I wanted to make a video today about a comparison between two acoustic guitars that are the same series, but uh, they have um, they have slightly different uh, pros and cons. And uh, I well, I bought this guitar for well over ten years, and this has been my my main workhorse in terms of like just a throw around acoustic guitar. It wasn't crazy expensive, but sounded and felt good, and had a couple of positive things about the preamp, which I'm going to explain in a minute. Um, so I'm going to let you just go online and uh, and find all the specs. This is the old version of the A3M, the Yamaha A3M, and uh, the reason why I liked it is because it had like the dreadnought shape and it looked like a you know a, a old school guitar in a way, but it had an electric guitar neck, so it's a, it's a thinner neck, and uh, I really like that because it's very comfortable. And when you play for hours, you know you're, you're doing a sound check. Or running a show in the afternoon and then you have to do two shows in the evenings this is a this is a great you know great selling point and then the first version the old version had this maybe a bit bulkier uh preamp set up but the the sound basically this is a bit like the modern version of a lot of acoustic guitars they have the the piezo but also they have the physical modeling as far as i understand it of a recording of the uh of the same guitar recorded in a in a really good studio with different microphones and different you know and different uh preamps and stuff like that so it has basically three type of microphones the, the old version has three type of microphones with uh recorded close up and slightly further away about like a foot away if i understand well and then there is this resonance um blend that really um gives the guitar a bit more of a, like a real feel like there was a microphone and there obviously there is no microphone this is just you know a, a bit like a physical modeling you know a modeler kind of situation so also there is a tuner which the new version doesn't have and the empathy back which the new version has but is is kind of hidden in a way um and obviously you, you know like most guitars you can blend between the piezo and the um uh, you know, and the, the physical modeling version, you know, the simulation of the microphone version. In it. So this is the, the old version, where the new version has a slightly different design, a slightly different design internally, and as far as, as, far as I understand, it has different bracing, and that's why it sounds a bit more like, a, you know, a, a fatter version of the old one in a way. It has more bass. Even this, even though this has a different finish, is the same guitar, same woods, same neck shape, and all that. What changed um, is the system. Obviously, they wanted to maybe look similar to the more modern guitars, a bit like the Taylors and stuff like that. Uh, but so there is less disruption in the wood, so this big, both visually and I guess as a you know, the physics. But there are only two modular sounds. There's no um there's no tuner and i have found this preamp to be a bit noisy in terms of the hiss like when i record now and record direct not with a microphone there's a bit of a hiss and a bit of like a, a honky resonance which is i mean if you're used to playing taylors you probably recognize you know what i mean it sounds like the you know the, the guitar is being recorded in a in a small room in a way so i would say uh, so there is kind of like honky resonance that is difficult to get rid of, you know. So uh, I would say that, and again, this is uh, powered, you know, the batteries, the compartment is a bit more hidden in a way, you know, but it's still powered by two AA, um, AA batteries. I would say in general, they're both good guitars. They're made in China, so they're not crazy expensive. There's a more expensive Japanese version. Um, but the reason why, as I said, why I bought these is so I could stick them in the back of a van or tour bus or whatever, or throw them in the back of the car. Um, they come with um, with a padded. Uh, let me find it. They both come with a with a padded um, case, a gig bag, which is you know that kind of hard foam um, case, and it's a it's a good value in terms of what you get for sure. Okay, so I'm not going to say that one is better than the other. But I would say that the applications, um, I'm more of a, you know, gigging musician rather than a recording musician. I do some recording, but not much compared to how much I play live, because that's what I want to do. 
And so I need a guitar that I can plug straight into the, the PA or the front of house. And I have to say that the old version works better in that way, where the new version works better acoustically, sounds better acoustically. So if you are a recording guitarist, I would go for the new version. If you're a, a live player where you just need to play or just, you know, when you record, you only plug into the, the desk, then I would go for the old version, which probably you'd, you can find a bit cheaper nowadays because it's been around for ages. Okay, so these are the two guitars. Um, the first one is the old model, and I'm going to go through the six presets of the microphone. Everything is flat, and I'm, going, I'm only on the microphone side, so to speak, the simulation. Okay, so this is the first one. <laughs> Same three microphones, but with the furthest uh, setting. Okay, so this is a new version, and uh, this is just the direct sounds. Same thing now, just using the microphone from the uh, the camera, and because uh, I thought that would give more a bit of a sense of the room, but rather than recording through a, a mic like a Gunnar's microphone. <laughs> Right. Um, I hope this really helped this out. And uh, again, if you want to subscribe, that's great. You know, hit the subscribe like button so you can keep up with all the videos that I'm posting. And that really helps the channel in general. If you want to share also through social media, uh, that's great. And if you want to leave a comment, uh, see what you think about these guitars. And uh, if you want to have any, you know, any questions in general. Uh, all right. Take care.